All right, you ready? Do I have it on my teeth? No. I'm ready, cowgirl. Okay. All right, thanks. <laughs> <laughs> this is the story of two best friends who decided to start a beer review channel in the middle of a pandemic. We're Karen Candy and we are Two Blondes Drink Beer. Hi, welcome back to Two Blondes Drink Beer. I'm Candy and this is Kara. Hey. And today we are drinking our favorite category at 20C. We are drinking Left Hand Brewing's Galactic Cowboy. Nitro. Nitro. I love me some nitro. You know I love some nitro. Let's talk about the can. I like the can. It's a pretty color. It's, it's got, got like a cowboy a, with a like moon. A galaxy a... kind of situation going on. Stars. Yeah. It's yeah. good fun. It's pretty. Love Speaking it. Speaking of the stars, we saw some... It's got a widget. You ready? There it is. In the sky, we saw some satellites last night when we were we outside. We did. We were doing some stargazing. <laughs> oh, okay. I probably oh. need to do a hard pour. That's right. Don't forget. Hard pour. Hard pour. It's opposite of normal. Let's not go crazy. What are you okay. doing over Sorry. there? Sorry. Oh, it's so pretty. Gotta love a nitro, guys. Ta -da! I mean, look how pretty. Can you see how pretty... Watch it settle. So fun. It's amazing. You stay out there. Yeah. So I'm talking what to my she dog. Said. Oh, it looks so good. It's gorgeous. Love it. Ah. Yay. So this is one of Left Hand Brewing's year rounds. But weirdly enough, I didn't think we'd had it, but we have had it once. I do not remember having it. I didn't look to see if we like maybe it was at a festival or something. Yeah. I don't know where we <clears> had <throat> it, but apparently we've had it once. Um, I saw it in the store and did not think I had had it and went, huh, an Imperial Stout Nitro I haven't had. I do but, not uh, remember this. I don't know. Left hand's in Colorado, right? Longmont, Colorado. Really close to where my daughter's going to school. It is very close to Annika. Oh. Uh, we like us a lot of left hand brewing. We do. Beers. <laughs> the most infamous one that we've done is probably the Milk Stout, which has the cow. Yes, it's all cow. cow beers are good beers. Ain't that the truth? We have a cow playlist. Yeah. I'll link to it. But this one's a 9%. It's not crazy for an Imperial Stout oh. at all. So I felt like it was almost a laundry stout. It's like borderline. <laughs> borderline. It's like I've had a really hard day and I want something, but I it's might still day. have one more thing to do. Yes. Or I don't want to wake up tomorrow with a headache. Yeah. Um. Yeah. Uh, but I giggled. It was something like... It's smoother than Han Solo and darker than Darth Vader. <laughs> <laughs> That's hilarious. Which was funny. That's funny. <laughs> Smells good. Mm -hmm. You're just going right for it, huh? <laughs> just skip past the first two categories. I'm I'm here for breaking the rules. I got excited. Rules are made and to be broken. It. Oh, that's lovely. Oh, it is good. It's chocolatey and, and mm. coffee. So it has two different, it's got a milk chocolate and a dark chocolate in it. It has no coffee, but that, that stout just has that coffee flavor. Wow. Yeah. It's rich. It it's is. dark. It's kind of bitter. It is kind of bitter. It tastes like <clears throat> espresso dark chocolatey bitter. It's drying. I'll go back if Let's you want. Let's just skip all the way to mouthfeel. <laughs> <laughs> Overall drinking, drinking pleasure <laughs> and scene. And we're done. And we're out. Um, okay. We're doing aroma? Yeah. Let's start there. <laughs> I forgot. We've only done it. Smells like one. toast. Yeah. But like a little bit like burnt toast. Is that funny? Yeah. Is it on your nose? It smells like toast. Toast? Um, smells like bitterness. That's a taste, not a smell. I'm struggling. That smells like bitter chocolate. It does. And a little bit like coffee. That's all I got. But yeah. I don't know. 10 out of 12. I'm sure. Um, Appearance three uh, out of three. Six out of three. Because I love nitro. It's like look at the nitro. Foamy, it's so pretty. So pretty. Left hand has a lot of nitro beers. I feel like they, they do, do them well. The the widget. Yes. The widget. They do. And the can. Do them well. They do. Right. They do do. Mm -hmm. They do do. You yep. know they do do. All right. Mm -hmm. And then the taste. So. What's the galactic cowboy story? I don't know if there is one. Galactic Cowboys a yeah. heavy metal. It's a heavy metal band out of Texas. I oh, don't really? know them. Yeah. It made me think of Giddy the up. song Rhinestone Cowboy. Yeah. And I don't know why, but that one was cracking up so that's been going through my head. Uh, but I do happen to have a one one a cowgirl hat in my possession. So I put it on. I don't think I have one. You need one. 
You Every need girl one. on spring break needs a straw cowgirl hat. This is a prerequisite. For we all know this. South Padre Island. For any of those. <laughs> I bought this. Actually, I bought it in P-Town. Oh, you did? Which is a delightful LGBTQ Q plus friendly. community in Massachusetts. Yeah. At the very end of Cape Cod. Um, in a hat. A, like a like hat, a hat shop. store. Like it was a for real hat shop. So, like, literally, me, my husband, and my two kids all found a hat, and we wore them the rest of the vacation. It was kind of fun. I did not own anything close to a cowboy Speaking hat. Speaking of hats, let's talk about your husband. He ordered two more this week. So. You guys. I don't know why. It's becoming a problem. But he's in a hat phase. He is. And, and I, who knew that was a thing? I enjoy the man in hats. He looks good in a hat. Now, he has no. like some of the most luscious, beautiful hair that I've ever yeah. seen on a man's head. But I do like the quirkiness that he like enjoys himself in a hat. That's okay. fun. Now, I just, but not all the time. No. And, and not, you don't understand the hat stuff that's coming to my house. What's there's the these, new ones? There's like a special brush for them. There's like extend extender fitter things that like go on the inside to make them fit perfectly. The new one is like a, it was like a dark green felt wide brimmed, not a fedora, but kind of a fedora. And then also like a newsboy cap that fits closer to his head because this other one he has is really puffy and reminded me of a mushroom and he knows I hated it and he would wear it all the time. Doesn't mean get another one. He got one that's not puffy and mm-hmm. I do I do think it looks better on him. But can we just stop? I keep telling him you only have one head. Don't make that dirty, guys. Don't make it dirty. <laughs> it is bitter, isn't it? It's it's like dark chocolate. I It's... I don't know. It's like the 75% cacao, cacao. chocolate. It like took over. Like the bitter dark yeah. chocolate took over the middle. The the middle. I wouldn't like it if it weren't nitro. It's that's, not middle it chocolate. It smooths it out. It's, it's milk chocolate. Middle chocolate. There's no middle chocolate. You have like the sweet chocolate, oh my the God. middle chocolate, we have, the Speaking chocolate, of chocolate, obviously. we have a bowl of Easter candy that's been in, on our island. <clears throat> There are all these little eggs in there. I had already eaten all the peanut butter cups. It's Palmer candy. I don't know why it tastes so much better than Hershey's, but it does. And so I'd eaten all the peanut butter cups, and then Kevin had eaten all the solid chocolates, which were in the shapes of, like, carrots and bunnies and whatever. And all these eggs were left. I thought they were regular solid chocolate. Mm -hmm. I'm just not a huge fan of it. Whatever. I was wrong. It is, like, white chocolate with cookie crumb stuff or whatever and it's oh, so yeah. good and like why was I eating those all along? just realized our can say it. three two one let's, let's jam, jam. <laughs> <laughs> like, like a rhinestone cow this is for earthers butlers and dusters alike that's what it says right it is what it says but I don't understand it super smooth galactic. and cosmically dark it is cosmic meat <laughs> Good to go from the can, like a pro in a glass. This copy is funny. <laughs> look, at, look at you reading without your reading glasses. I know. I'm impressed with Who your eyeballs I? right now. Well, the font, this good job. Good job. With the colors and the font you left helped, hand. You, you helped this old lady you can, read. <laughs> yes. yeah. What are we on? Uh, I'm not quite sure. Ooh. Flavor, maybe? We haven't rated flavor. Flavor town. I mean, we kind of started flavor, then we went back to aroma. Appearance. I just started drinking and I was like, we're drinking beer. Mix it That's up. what we're doing up in here. We're drinking beer. What, what? Hold on. Okay. Speaking of dark chocolate. Speaking of egg, eggs, chocolate I eggs. I these from the kids. Yeah, you did. Uh, oh, no, that's my teeth. Don't do that. It's bad for them. See? Mm. Mm. See, we can have four of them for 150 calories. I need a bag of these. I hid them from the children when they didn't put them in the eggs. and It's like a little... Drop. <laughs> oh, wait. I about broke a tooth. Hello, Spring. Oh. They also say stuff on them. That's fun. Wet life bloom. Ah, that's mm. kind of dumb. Yeah, that's kind of lame. I don't know about that, Dove. That's Is like it a... Dove? No. Yeah. So, yeah, Dove. Mm-hmm. Dove eggs. That goes well with this, though. They're like half eggs, though. They are. It's weird. I don't know why it says an egg. That's only half an egg. Two eggs. You need two of them to make an egg. Two of them to make an egg. That means we get eight, I think, because that's... (laughs) So pair this with dark chocolate. Mm -hmm. Of any kind. Unless you're Annika, in which case you can have milk chocolate. chocolate. All right. Um, 
So I'm going to give it 15 out of 20. Embrace new beginnings. I like that one. That's good. That's fun. We can do that. This is fun. You can, what, it's like a fortune cookie. What new beginning are we going to embrace? <laughs> I'm not starting to <laughs> like thick. <laughs> Why do you like bite into it like a heathen? <laughs> I did eat the whole it. thing? No, I suck on it and I let it gently like dissolve into the crevices of my mouth. Slow and luxuriously. <laughs> I like chocolate. Wow. I like chocolate a lot. You notice I had it hidden in my office. You guys, I can't have candy in my house because not only do my kids take it and immediately eat it, my husband... I'll eat like one or two of these a day. He'll come in, he'll be like, I'm just gonna take a few of these. I'll see you later. And then he, he eats them all. And then when I like really want some chocolate, there's none there. That's bullshit. So I, I get it in my house and I hide it. <laughs> like every good mom does. <laughs> The 9%. I chew getting, my chocolate. No, you gotta let it dissolve. I'm noticing that you do that. You like you that? Your melt. No, just chew it. Like I it's eat it. Good. It gets real good when you let it like it. warm up with your spit. <laughs> <laughs> this video is a shit show. <laughs> do you have like saved Zillow searches set up like I do? No. You don't? No. Why are you leaving me? <laughs> well, I'm, you're going to have to need to get a place near me. I hate I... Missouri, though. Well, you could. Yeah. Spring is a promise of new hopes. Where are we? So I get it 15 out of 20 on my flavor. I oh, I think I agreed. I agree okay. with that. Okay. Yeah. So we're so on the mouthfeel. Mouth and it is bitter and drying Hold on, and though. astringent. I, don't, I wouldn't call it heavy. Would you call it heavy body? Because no. I think it's more medium. But I would call it medium body. No, it's not heavy. But carbonated and so smooth, and smooth. in your mouth. I mean, that nitro. Mm. Mm. Very astringent. Very bitter on the Three end. out of five. It sucks a lot of moisture out of yeah, there. Yeah, because it's just a little too dry for me. It's very bitter. It's a little too bitter for me. I get it is the opposite of sweet. Yes. Bitter. <laughs> if you don't like bitter chocolate, you will hate this beer. You'll hate it. <laughs> <laughs> True story. Yeah. Truth. Your overall, overall drinking pleasure. pleasure. Cowgirl. <laughs> oh my God. I'm going to give it a 7 out of 10. Same. Now with the dark chocolate half egg, I'm going to bump it up eight. to 8. Yeah, that's good with that. Mm-hmm. Eight out of ten if you got you some chocolate. Agreed. Seven out of ten if you don't. Fudge. And this is not like a I'm sitting by the pool and I'm hot and I want to cool off beer. I Just so we're clear. Mm -mm. I know we're drinking it when the weather's changing. But we love a stout. We love a stout year round. Don't get me wrong. And but you know you got a fire pit in the spring still. It's an evening beer. It's an after dinner beer. It's a weekday fire pit beer. Yeah, because it's not 11 or 12, like it's a lot nine. of Imperial Stouts. Nine. You guys can do nine. It's nothing. Nine, nine times. times. <laughs> we drank some other stuff before this beer. <laughs> I think they know. <laughs> Just so you know, this isn't only this beer. <laughs> it's going to be a shock to no one. So, I get, well, hold on, I got to do math. Oh, shit. I don't remember the beginning of okay. this video. <laughs> Who are you? <laughs> Let's take off eight overall. Let's just make it up entirely. Yeah, With that's no, the overall scoring. Yeah, yeah, there's no rhyme or reason. I just feel like it's a 42 out of 50 beer. Agreed. And I will still say it's a 43 out of 50 beer if you eat it with some chocolate. Yeah, totally. Right? Yes. Yeah. For left hand brewing companies, Galactic Cowboy Nitro! Cheers! 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 That's how they say that. Now you say cheers! <laughs> cheers! Mm -hmm. Did you see in Yellowstone that those two are actually a couple? The I two. Uh, Tell me it's Beth and Rip. Nope. Uh huh. It's, they are it's a girl. The romance. country singer girl. Oh, okay. On her boyfriend. Oh, I don't, with the long blonde hair. Yeah. Like the extensions that I just bought. Yeah, I love them. Oh! Just trim them a little 
bit, but not a lot. I'm going to take them to Anna and have her trim them because... I think I need some. I have some that my color... I bought two because they were $15. Oh. And I, the one I showed you was the ones that totally matched my hair. Yeah. But the other ones might match your hair. So, I don't know if you guys noticed, but our hair grew exponentially from the last time you saw us. I don't know what you're talking about. 